is going on YouTube? It's about 7.30 in the morning and we're going on a road trip. Got my bags packed and we are heading to my hometown in South Texas this weekend. And we got about a few different spots I wanna hit along the way. So uh, let's go ahead and go. We are at our first stop here at the Ross. I'm not sure you guys can see that here and just outside of Corpus Christi I've never actually been here I drive by it all the time every time I go to my hometown so let's go ahead and go inside real quick before we go to the outlets and uh, see if we can find anything I did find some of these lower tier air maxes for about 16 bucks they're going anywhere from 49 to 59 so uh, you know low investment I'm gonna go ahead and pick these up and uh, price accordingly just for a quicker flip so I ended up uh, leaving those air maxes behind I double checked and they had permanent marker on the soles come on Ross so I know it's gonna be All right, first outlet of the trip. The outlets here in just outside of Corpus. If you guys live in the area, shout out. I think there's one seller here that I uh, see his listings frequently called the Frugal Fox. If you're watching, shout out to you. Um, it is Thursday, so I don't really think I'm gonna find too many deals. The deals are usually on the weekends, but you know, it doesn't hurt to poke your head and to see what we find. So no back wall discount. I will probably have to come up uh, Sunday back here to see what we find. Looks like there's a lot of potential items for me to pick up. So we're going to go ahead and go through the aisles to see if we can find some stock X flips or anything that's just a really good deal. And then probably go next door to Converse and then go continue the road trip. Going down the lifestyle shoes, check out these Industrex 49.97. The, uh, comps are decent but the sell through rate is not there so uh, you have some pretty good deals here just uh, they would be a lot better on the weekend so still nothing here but check these shops out yeah, they're pretty cool haven't seen those before 104.99 but uh, nothing else really at a pricing point that uh I would like 97's 129 so I'm going through the aisles this looks like a good deal I'm gonna hop on as well as this one I'm still double checking some comps but we're gonna go ahead and probably pick up 10 of those and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do that now so I'm gonna go ahead and pick up 10 piece of these and I did two stock X flips so we're gonna go ahead and I got two more aisles to check out Let's see if there's any more deals before we get out of here. Doing my last little round, and I did come across a couple of very cheap and inexpensive runners. So we're gonna check these out as well for 20 bucks. That's a pretty good, pretty good deal. All right, Corpus. That was pretty surprising. I did not expect to find anything here today on a Thursday, but I went ahead and picked up 10 pairs of those Air Max Sasha's for 20 bucks. So at that price range, you can't beat it. I believe the comps were anywhere between 49 to 59, so not huge margins, but it is a multiple quantity listing, and that's something that I prefer, especially being a you know a one-man team over here. And I went ahead and picked up five pairs of those Air Max or those Air Force One mids in blue. Um, was gonna pick up 10, but I just felt uh, I just felt those shoes were gonna sit there for a little bit, so I felt more comfortable with just buying five. And then lastly, the uh, Air Force highs in women's. I bought two pairs of those, and those were to flip on StockX, which means I've already sold them before I even left the store. And I gotta go. I gotta go buy boxes now. I'm on vacation, so I gotta find something. But I'm gonna go ahead and get, uh, grab some grub, and then we're gonna go to a Goodwill down the street and uh, check that place out as well. Next spot, Goodwill. Man, it's crazy outside. Came across some Sorrells. $14.99, got random greenness on there. Did find these Tony Llamas, but the columns aren't too great. About 25 bucks, they're asking 14, so we're gonna leave those behind. 
And then I did see these custom Pikachu. Daddy, Pikachu? Faded glories. Damn, Daniel. Nothing too crazy on this end. So let's go ahead and go on the other side of this shoe rack. Oh, there they go. Damn it. So nothing too crazy in the shoes. But I did come across this vintage Converse piece right here. Asking nine bucks. And it is my size, so <laughs> I'm gonna have to consider if I want this for me or uh, check the comps. We got the custom Pepe Le Pew player tee. 339. And it's my size. What's going on? <laughs> so there was nothing in that Goodwill worth flipping. Uh, I did, did find some hilarious Looney Tunes Pepe Le Pew shirt uh, that I got for the collection. And uh, that was about it. So we're going to go ahead and continue the road trip. And we're going to probably start on day two. Um, it's about 2.30, so it's going to take me about another three hours on my road trip. So I'm probably going to get to my uh, folks' place and just kind of relax for the evening and uh, continue on tomorrow. So I was on a mission to go to a Marshalls down the area, but I got lost and found this Goodwill. So let's go ahead and go inside real quick. It smells like straight up boo-boo in here. No, no lie. Check out these Reebok Kool-Aids. Oh yeah! So there was no shoes to be had there. I was contemplating the Kool-Aids, but you gotta, you know, you gotta check the comps and can't lie to yourself. As fun as of a pickup that would have been, you know, the, the numbers weren't there. But we did pick up that Harley Davidson snap, uh, snap down. I'm not sure if I caught it on camera, so I'll go ahead and put it up here. And uh, that seems to be going for about 45 online. I picked it up for four bucks here, so. Here we are at Marshall's, which was down the road from the Goodwill. I'm seeing a lot of boosts, but they've been kind of oversaturated, pure boosts. Let's go to the men's and see if there's anything. It appears to be the same old, same old. These have been in and out of plenty of Marshalls and Rosses actually, $59.99. I'll check stock X, but for the most part, I doubt it. QTs, yeah, these have been flooding. So let's go ahead and check those. What are these? Tubulars. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and check my stock X app, but I do not think there's gonna be anything here. So not too much on the StockX app. There was potential to flip a size 13, but no 13s to be had here. Now we're going through my favorite section, which is the clearance, and uh, see if we can find any deals here. Here's some Harachas for $39.99. I'll check those out. So no luck at that Marshalls. Uh, it seemed like it was the same old, same old. I did see a pair of Harachas that were, um, profitable but at the same time they did have a small stain so I'm not even gonna mess with it it was actually on the soles or on the uh, on the toe box so not messing with it put it back and we are back on the road so this is the last leg of the trip Marshalls in Brownsville Texas and it will be the last stop for the day looks like shock nation uh, yeah, we're still gonna look around, but it looks like the same inventory and they marked the boxes. What is going on here? That is unsatisfactory. Let me go ahead and look around. Clearance section is pretty dry as well. And still looking though. I think we're ready to get out of here. Yeah. It is time to wrap it up. I'm getting some food. I'm gonna spend some time with the family. See you guys bright and early tomorrow. Outlets, Mercedes, Texas. But before we end the video, foodie shot. Border towns have the best food. Nothing can beat this.
All right, that's all I had. See you guys. All right, so it's the next day. Here we are at the Rio Grande Valley outlets. I'm still a little early. I've only been to this outlet once before, so I'm gonna kind of walk around, get the blood flowing. It's about 9.15, so we still got about 45 minutes. Nike's right here. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and check out the layout before they open. Got 20% off. So let's go ahead and browse the back wall. I'm not seeing any deals right away, but let's go ahead and go right on in. So we went ahead and found us a deal right here. 21.97 Nike Pre-Love Oxes, retail of 80. So we'll probably sell them anywhere between 54 to 59. I'm still looking through. Uh, I think we have one or two more. We got to check, but good deal. Okay, we did find a good stock X flip here. Air Jordan 3 or 13 retro grade schools. And I still got to check uh, these others, which I doubt. But uh, you know, double check to be safe. But we're gonna go ahead and go through the listings here on StockX. All right, guys, just finished doing three StockX flips right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and get ready to check out. Can't wait for these to go on sale, but we are good to go. Not too bad. Just look at all this bulk buying back here. That just goes to show that there is plenty to go around though, so. So we left the outlet with about 27 pairs back there. A uh, nice little haul and with 20% on the back wall I'll have to check if the one outlet in Corpus does have that as well that way when I make my way back up we can browse that back wall to see if there's any deals or whatever scraps that are left but uh, overall good day and we are back in Austin um, back at my place I ended up not going back to the Corpus outlet Sunday uh, as I was driving by it I, I was pretty beat the Jeep was pretty packed and that's the haul right there about 45 pairs including the five pairs I flipped to StockX and I had mailed them out already because today was the deadline so a uh, pretty good haul I did pick up a little bit of a uh, thrift thrifted items like that Harley Davidson tee as well as uh, those Kool-Aid shoes so uh, overall not a bad trip I'm gonna have to break this down. I'm actually on my last day of vacation from the day job, so I'm gonna have to process this as quickly as I can and uh, just get up, get it up and get it online. And that's all the time we have for today's video. Give it a thumbs up, feel free to hit the sub button. And if you like these kind of road trip Paul videos, feel free to leave a comment down below and I'll see you guys on the next flip. Oh yeah!